Hi, today I'm gonna to show you how to make these really cute, simple DIY pillows, and you're going to be using placemats. Yep, that's right, placemats. They're really simple, really quick, and they're very cost effective. So you're going to get yourself a seam ripper, which usually comes in most sewing kits, um, and then you're going to make sure you get a placemat. The placemat, you wanna make sure that it's a double-sided placemat, meaning that there is a seam to rip out. And then you're just gonna find the seam at the end of the placemat, and you're going to just begin to rip it out. Um, this part right here is, um, you know, just make sure you're ripping the seam, not too much, unless you like to sew. I don't like to sew, so I just make sure I get just enough opening so that I can stuff it. So here you are, I'm just kind of showing you how it begins to rip open. And um, yeah, just keep working with it until you get that opening perfect. That's exactly what you want. So then you're going to, um, of course, put away your seam ripper because it's sharp. You're gonna get yourself some polyfill. I get polyfill from Walmart. You can get it from Joanne's Fabric. I also have a link in my on my blog to show you, you can get it online. Um, anyway, you're just gonna stuff that pillow. And, oh, not pillow, placemat. And what I like to do here is I try to get my kids involved. I make it a race. Everything's fun when it's a race. I open up a few of them and then I let them go at it. Whoever can get it filled the quickest wins. And voila, I have myself a nice pillow for my home decor for whatever season that I'm working with. So right now this is a fall pillow. I have it good and stuffed and that's exactly how I like it. And then once you have it stuffed, you're gonna wanna stitch up the side where you ripped open. Now, this is not, I am not a sewer and I don't really, <laughs> I wanna learn how to sew, I'm just not good at it yet. So anyway, just go ahead and stitch that up. If you don't know how to sew, you can always staple it. Shh, you can staple it because this is a decorative pillow. You're not supposed to play with it. You're not going to be laying on it. It's just going to look pretty. So anyway, get it stitched up however you want to do that and then you have yourself a pillow. So that's it. That's really quick. It costs less than two to three dollars to make it. I got these um, placemats from I think Tuesday morning for like four, four, five dollars. So there you are. Thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe and have fun creating. Thank you.